We're in parts unknown, and we're here with the uh, Squatch Watchers. They invited us back again. Cinnamon Sugar's back to do another Bigfoot hunt with the Squatch Watchers. And uh, so we're out here. They're trying to make me and the believers. Neither one of us believe in Bigfoot. We're bringing our good friend and research member, David Martin, with us tonight. He is the Bigfoot expert. Tonight, I'm called in with the group to lead this expedition and try to get Dee and Gary on board to finally get them an experience that they can no longer deny Bigfoot is real. This is one of our hot spots. We've been hunting this property for 12 years. We have so much evidence, so much excitement, it's hard for us to kind of pinpoint it all. Last time we came, we had some activity. Not only could I not explain it, but it was it was just weird. So I am not gonna say we haven't experienced things. We've found a footprint. It was bigger than my foot by a lot, wider than my foot by a lot. I can't explain it. We, there was two of them. Move, hang on, hang on. Look at that one. Look how deep that goes. There you go. Look at that. There. All I want to do is just tea. He just work. needs to just sit there long enough. I thought maybe another one. Maybe. Dave's making a cake. Look at that. Textbook, Dave. Textbook. I'm Taylor Cook, research member of the NC Squatch Watchers. My expectations are high. They're always high. You can't come in negative just like you can't go into a football game thinking that you're going to lose. We're here to find something. That's what we're going to do. So there's things that I can't explain, but it still hasn't made me a believer because I need to see things to believe. I need to see a Bigfoot or get attacked by a Bigfoot. It's a lot harder to make me a believer, but that's what we're here for to try and find out. scares you the most? I'm not really afraid of any animals. I'm faster than a lot of guys here that they would get caught before I do, so I have no reason to be scared of anything. That's just the truth, I'm sorry. <laughs> and if push comes to shove, tripping works. <laughs> sorry, D. <laughs> Bro, look, I, I'm gonna tell you right now, and I, I can't make this up. I don't know where we are, but I am deathly terrified of bears, bro. That's my animal. You know how people would be like, oh, you know, I'll burn my house down if I found a snake or if I ran into this type of bears. Yeah, that's my animal. Cougar, mountain lion, it's the only one. Mountain lion. The most scariest wildlife we could run into or not would be a mountain lion. And we have had to shut a hunt down because of it. Uh, the only reason I'm worried about a cougar is because it's the only animal in North America that will actively hunt a human for its prey. Uh, you won't see it, it's gonna get you. It's gonna come from above. Um, I, all jokes aside, if, if it attacks, one of us is not going home, everybody else gets to make it out while it's killing the other. It is, it is what it is. That is a real danger out here. It was loud a second ago. It was boom, boom, and you're oh, boom, yeah, you boom, can hear the chants. Boom. They're supposed to be recording with the drum. You can hear the, 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 the chants. Yeah, you can hear the chants. Just now come get us. We just got back. We just got back. We were out here. We just got yelling. back. We heard lumber knocking. No lie, lumber knocking this way. We run towards it. We stop here in the middle of the field. Start hearing Native American tribal like, oh, we heard, we heard, we heard echo. We, heard the, we the heard the chant. We didn't hear the drums. Yes. It, we it heard the chant. Like music. Yeah. We heard the drums, and all of a sudden, right after that started, the wind. It was silent and calm. The wind started blowing like it is right now. Well, the wind always blows. Yeah. Well, the wind always blows. I know. But it's I'm like, just yeah. as a skeptic, you know. I, 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 I got to call I, out. I understand. It's just weird to me. Yeah. You hear tribal chatter, yeah, I will say drum beating, wind me, blows. When me and D got here, we heard the tribal chanting. We, we, we did not hear the tribal chanting. Yeah. We, we heard, we heard yes. the tribal we chanting. The, yeah. the very yeah. end of the, the ha, ha ha ha, whatever it was. Yeah. I don't know how it was I doing. Mean, <laughs> Bug flew in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. So, Gary, do you can you explain that at all, though? So I can't explain it. I would say my my rationale trying to explain it would be maybe somebody was uh, doing something on one of the houses above because our house is up there. I'm not saying that's what it was, but that's my only rational reason of explaining it. I don't think I can explain it other than that. But I think the biggest thing is just if we could have uh, heard it multiple times, which we have more night to go, so we could still hear it. I think that would be the telling truth for us to hear it over and over again, not just one off and not hear it again. I got your keys. I'm gonna put them in there. That was terrifying. <laughs> okay. I was. Oh, you got one on your face. A big ass. Oh, that was big as fuck. <laughs> Did you get that on camera? I couldn't even say that because I was so scared. I was like, oh shit. <laughs> I hope it's on camera. Bro, it looked like it used to be on your phone. <laughs> Please tell me you see this. Wait, oh. girl, we have to zoom into that. We have to zoom in. No. The spider was big, bro. Oh, we're going to drive over there. Yeah. All right, we heading out? I think we're going to head over there. Yeah. Where? <laughs> Bro, it really, I was like, was it a big one? I just pointed. They all saw it too and oh, couldn't no. say nothing. To give you a backstory on the new side of the property that we're going to introduce Dean Gary to tonight, we've been over here for about a month or two, and crazy stuff's happened about every time we've been over here. So hopefully it keeps happening tonight. The family of Sasquatch have been pushed to this side of the river now. So we think we get more activity over here because there's more of them over here. And Gary's knocking behind me, so let's get to it. These are tree knocking sticks. Used to, we take one stick out of the woods, find it somewhere, and just bang it on a tree. These tree knocking sticks go like this. And you always want to do three, because I've always been told if you do, that's aggressive. You don't want to do that. So, we think it is somebody's playing music. We don't know if it's actual chanting. We think it's somebody actually playing music. We're gonna find out, we'll try and walk and see. We've been over here before and one of our former people we went with before had mentioned there's rumors that there's cults that do shit out here. We don't know what we're gonna try and find out. That's what told me. Look, look yeah, Gary, yeah. I, I'm the only black person out here, me and Evan. I, I don't know about this coat stuff that they talking about. We supposed to be looking for Bigfoot. I, I'm not, I ain't trying to roll up on no coat. This ain't Ozark. This ain't, <laughs> it's not where we at. If we found Bigfoot, right? Mm -hmm. Do you think he'd be aggressive? I've heard of two different, aggressive Bigfoot. Like in Texas, they claim that their Bigfoot are aggressive with snout and nose. So here, I don't think they'd be too aggressive. We have had something or a Bigfoot shake trees at us and push trees down, but I don't think they're trying to hurt us. Hey, listen, listen. He's gonna do it back. Right? He's gonna do him back. Listen. Call, baby, call. Big one, big one. We're rolling. Yeah. It's gonna be loud. Move up now? Yeah, I'm down. Move further up? Yeah. My expectations tonight is just this. We're gonna walk around a lot. It's gonna be dark. It's gonna be fun. Can you imagine how much fun we're having? We're walking through woods that we've never, ever been in. And the most mysterious thing that I've noticed out here in these particular woods, and I really want you to understand this, is I hadn't seen any wildlife. No rabbits, no squirrels, no deer, like, I, I heard an owl for the first time today. Bear trap. Hey, oh, Gary, shit. this is recent too, bro. That ain't recent. How the hell you gonna a, tell me, bro? So that, that's fucking they, recent, two they, days they, ago. They, 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 what was it? Something's thrown. No, I heard that. Oh, everybody heard that. Bro, where the fuck are y'all going? Where are y'all going? We're going, let's go. Wait, you don't think we should head towards it? No, did nobody head towards it, bro.
tree. That's a bear. Yep. There's a bear right there? Hey, wait, wait, why are we following a bear track? Oh, shit. Hell no, I, felt, I saw D'Angelo run and I just kind of followed him, bro. And we're back. Oh, hell no, y'all ain't leaving me in the back. Uh, honestly, from our past experiences, I'm gonna say we will probably hear a knock or two. We might hear a rocket thrown. Other than that, I don't think we'll hear it happen, anything else happen, but uh, I'm hoping a lot more yeah, happen. Like a big splash in the river. Oh, we going in, Doug. He's he he they found it and they threw it back. Look, it's just a field of sand and water on it. It might have landed right here. No, it's splash. I didn't hear the splash. We honestly. heard it go in the water. I heard it. It's laying right here. See what this one's mine. Good job. You've got movement. There's something definitely moving. I'm gonna throw a rock. Please do. Mm. That was me. God almighty. <laughs> the tape, there's something right here that's interesting. What's that? Those rocks? Yep. Because they're broke. And they're a different color. Is it, are they chipped? <laughs> yes, they've been beaten on. See, you see the marks right here? Yep. All this has been chipped off. Should you beat on the rock? Well, is that us? Throw. Was that us? Did you throw that? No, we're right here. I'm saying, did you throw it? No, that's not, that's not them. Here, I'm gonna throw something. This one's me. Head up just a little bit so he's got room to get up on, out of the river. <clears throat> Waterproof boots. You want to go up and go somewhere else? Yeah, let's go uh, take a left when we get out of this trail to the next trail. That was good for him. How's it going? this one. Throw it. Throw it. Throw it. This one? Yep. I didn't hear that one hit. Yeah, it was. What the hell? He called it. I don't know about that. See? That was weird. We, there was a night where, it has been years ago, Taylor Throw another one the same way. So, we were throwing potatoes. Nine, and we were sitting down, tossing them up into the woods. And I'll be damned if one of them didn't come back. And that was no joke. Okay, that first, first one didn't one land, guys. Yeah, you want to throw one? Yeah, I'll throw one. Okay. Do you want to actually throw one? Sure. Yeah, throw this one. Get off Twitter. <laughs> I wasn't on Twitter. Throw it that way. There you go. Sure. You play football? Yeah, kind of. I was the kicker. <laughs> you a fool, bro. <laughs> bro. I just pulled every muscle down my thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you retired, bro. <laughs> if you've never been on a Bigfoot hunt, I try to tell everybody you're never going to see one just jump right out. It doesn't happen that easy. What you will do is you will feel Bigfoot. You will hear Bigfoot. And sometimes you're going to smell it. Smell it. Smell it. I just got a whiff of it. We don't even know what's real and what's not at this point. We just know that there is a creature on this property we believe is Bigfoot. So I will say another thing that they have said is uh, you'll get activity when you're just talking with each other. Mm -hmm. Like if you're not paying attention, Finger. you'll hear stuff. Yes. So that's what, some of the reason why we talk right now too is because mm -hmm. we're trying to let them get grab our attention versus us waiting to hear from them. 
If they're out there. Yeah. yeah I was a skeptic. If they're out there. Wow. Ah. Caught you on that one. <laughs> ah, it's getting close. No. I told you, I gotta see. I gotta see something. We can start walking back. Hey, you wanna do a call real quick? Yeah. While we're walking back, just to see if we hear anything as we're walking. I thought I heard water. I thought I heard something. I'm like, wait. We'll listen as we walk. Nick, you want to try it out? Oh, hell no. Y'all heard that? Yep. They're up there. We got something. You had something right here. We, we got something that broke a limb over here somewhere. Right here in this open little clearing. We're at branch and snap. Nice. Some nice stuff. Nice. I got one here. Okay, so we're throwing. Please, so be careful. Oh, yeah. Throwing two. A lot of times we forget to look up. Alright, you want to keep walking? Yeah. See if anything else happens. I had to sit back on the four-wheeler gear. <laughs> that you? That one of y'all? Well, y'all didn't hear that? I heard it. I didn't hear it. Oh, yeah. I heard something. I heard something right there over there. I got you. Got two. Got two throws. I, I heard, heard something fall. Oh, no. I, I got it on that. film. No, I heard the... Huh? Heads up. David's there over there. Oh, he I'm not here. That shit was kind of weak here. <laughs> and I said I could have did better. I'm just saying that shit was weak. We back outside. Gotta stay protected, bro. We out here. We Rain or shine. It's definitely raining, dog. Yeah, Something clearly was throwing stuff at us. Something clearly was throwing stuff in the creeks and the rivers. Is that us? Oh. Was that us? Did you throw that? No, we're right here. I'm saying, did you throw it? No, that's not. That's not I love it because we get this activity that some that are skeptics may say, oh, it could be something falling out of a tree, but falling out of a tree that many times leans a little more toward the believer side. The rock that I threw behind my back that never landed. What goes up must come down. I didn't hear that one hit. Yeah, it was. What the hell? The rock throwing in general tonight, the river rocks, and then the rocks hitting the woods, that was interesting. Biggest thing of all, though, when we first started, the Native American chanting and drum beating. It was loud a second ago. It was boom. Boom. And you're, oh, boom. Yeah, you can hear the chants. They're supposed to be recording with the their drum. We you can hear the chants. Yeah, That's you can the biggest thing. I do have to say, it could have been a bleed over. But, but the only thing I don't get is whenever y'all took the camera and y'all can listen to his recordings on his camera, whenever they're in the woods, you couldn't hear the music or anything at all. Bingo. But we were hearing it from the outside at the exact same time. I'm 100% saying it's the music. Uh, yes, I can't explain why it wasn't on his phone, yeah. but like it just made sense that it, there's music playing right there too. How would you rate this trip? Um, I would say it, it was hard to distinguish things because of the 
the noise from the people having the party and then the rain, five out of ten. Because it's hard because yeah. of the yeah, rain yeah, yeah, and the you. bleed over with the sound. Yeah. Like we had things that happened, but like I, I can't explain them. What? Hey, listen, listen. listen. Is that us? Was that us? I didn't hear that one hit. Yeah, it was. What the hell? Nick, you wanna try it out? Oh, hell no. Y'all heard that? Yep. Gotta sit back on the floor with it here. Is that you? Is that one of y'all? All right, well, we can head back then. Mm -hmm. That's a wrap. David, we do need to follow up on that trip. Oh no, I'm trying to turn my watch off so it doesn't beep when I'm talking. Go ahead, hit me with it again now. Okay. I'm Taylor Cook. Hang on. Got three, two, one. <laughs> um, tonight, we're bringing our good friend and research mem member, Lila. I'm David Martin of the NC Squatch Watchers. I'm also known as Super Dave. I go by many names. I'm just, start over. I would love to D'Angelo to get tackled by something. Like it would be awesome to see. Uh, I'd have to help, which would, he might get a couple punches in on him, but I'd get there at some point. But uh, I think that would be hilarious and hopefully we get it all documented. Oh, we always will. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we in for a lot of walking tonight because apparently, you know, Bigfoot don't like you rolling up in your car on him. So we'll see how it goes. That was pretty good. I know, y'all don't have to tell me. <laughs> <laughs>